Team Weather Lab, KMAC meteorologist Kellyanne Class. Well, we did have a strong low pressure system that moved on through yesterday, bringing us some windy conditions and wind gusts so far topped out at about almost 60 miles per hour in Morton. Rest of the South Plains reached about uh, 30 to 40 miles per hour and some 50 mile per hour wind gusts sprinkled on in there as well. Now, thankfully, early this morning, we are not waking up to any windy conditions. Winds right now are out of the north and west at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Our next thing that we're going to be tracking is a little bit of some rainfall and maybe even some snowfall in the forecast. Now, our Lubbock East Live Sky View showing clear conditions and dry conditions early this morning. We had that this low pressure system that moved on through. That storm system moved out, high pressure filled behind it, giving us those clear conditions. But we are tracking our next storm system by late tonight and early tomorrow morning. So, tracking it out for you by tonight, we'll get an increase in cloud cover as temperatures fall into the 20s and 30s by tomorrow morning. Just in time for your morning commute at about 7 a.m. Could see a few light uh, snow showers and even some flurries outside as well. Keep in mind this system that we're tracking not going to be widespread snowfall and in fact looks like it's going to be very scattered in nature. We could though see a few heavy bands that may produce a little bit more of that snowfall potential, but looks like snowfall potential not going to be much because temperatures out the surface are going to be above freezing, meaning that snow not going to stick to the ground. Still, though, going to make for some slick conditions on the roads. This is going to be a very quick moving system, not widespread. So by tomorrow, late afternoon, early evening, a few lingering showers, some cold rain off into the rolling plains. The rest of us are going to remain dry. That system moves out. Could see maybe a few lingering wraparound snow showers up to our north and west and a few cold rain showers up to our north by early on Friday morning. Otherwise, we are going to remain dry on Friday as temperatures once again slowly warm up from here, expected to be into the 50s by Friday afternoon. So in terms of how much snowfall we're expecting, not a lot. That's because we're not expecting this to be a very widespread, slow moving system. Also, temperatures at the surface are going to be above freezing, which means not expecting a lot of snow snowfall potential, maybe about a tenth of an inch with some locally higher mounts off to the north and west where we get some of those higher elevations and colder air sinking on in first. Otherwise, really not expecting a lot of accumulation in terms of snowfall. That's one model. Here's another model just to show you really not expecting a lot of snowfall accumulation. So that is the good news, but we're still going to be watching the system because it could still create some slick conditions by early tomorrow morning for your morning commute and by Friday morning as well as temperatures drop well below freezing. So breaking it all down of maybe a few flurries overnight tonight. Otherwise, snow for your morning commute tomorrow. Just a few flurries. Take your time. Everything clears out by the evening. A few light accumulations possible, but not expecting a big accumulation, but some slick roads. Temperatures right now are into the single digits and teens. That's those feels like temperatures by this afternoon, expecting actual high temperatures to warm up into the upper into the mid to upper 50s. Light winds will make it feel like that true 55 degrees. Though it cools down tomorrow, high temperatures into the upper 30s, lower 40s, but everything turns around this weekend as we get back into the 70s. Well, even though there's only a, been a tiny bit of snow since I've been here, I still get so excited. <laughs> I was outside, I was trying to make a tiny snowball. It probably looked pathetic to other people. But yeah, I don't think we're fun. going to get that much snow like we had last time, but still maybe a good coating on the roads, which means take your time on the roads, don't rush. We all want to get to our destination safely. Always so